Okay, now we're going to learn how to do some uh, text effects in Photoshop. Um, it's going to start a new document here. Let's make the uh, let's make the background black. Get a fill. Let's uh, start a new layer for our text. Uh, let's make the text uh, white. And um, let's type any effects out. Now, there's many ways to do this. Um, I mean, there's thousands of effects you can use on a Photoshop for text. You know, some are very uh, involved, and some are as simple as clicking a button. Um, I sh already showed you guys how to do a glow, so let's try some other things, shall we? Let's uh, go to a say you want to give your text a little bit of um, depth. I'm going to get a gradient overlay. And I'm sure uh, many of you have seen the kind of like metallic kind of reflection look a lot of our web 2.0 sites use. This is a very simple way to achieve a similar effect. We're going to bring the scale down on a black to white fade. Go to the opacity, bring that down a bit. And there you go, you got a, like, you got a nice little uh, kind of metallic and shiny look to that. That was pretty simple to do. We can go to color effects, you can change the uh, color to whatever you want, if you want to make it red, if you want to bring the opacity down so you get a bit of the gradient overlay you had already put on, you can do that too. If you want to say you want to make it look 3D, you can go to the bevel and emboss. You know, you can play with the effects of that, you know, how deep you want it to look. I mean, there's, you know, if you want to do a different contour, but there's plenty of different looks you can do. Um, if we had a white background, you can uh, put a drop shadow on it. And then if you like, if you, you know, if you spend a couple of hours working or, you know, even half an hour working on trying to get the perfect effect for your text, you can go to New Style and save it as, you know, whatever you want. You know, red, click OK. Now, the next time you uh, want to use that effect, go across to here where you see the color swatches styles, click on styles, scroll down the bottom and there's your new style that you had just created. Uh, Photoshop does come with a whole bunch of preset effects you can use. As you can see, simply click a button and you can get a whole, whole bunch of different looks for your, uh, for your text. It's quite easy really. So there you go, that's how we create text effects in Photoshop.